the display show is going to start in several minutes and please believe me that will be a show from the capital letter. Boys are very beautiful. Yes. We so, are okay. in 1940s <laughs> Paris Jazz Club. Yeah. Um, sort of. You know what? We're going to see it. We're going to take you there, and then we're going to come up to the future and say this is how we see it. You know, it might it's not be our interpretation of what it might have been, or could have been, or should have been back in the day. So you're flying a time machine, kind of. Kind of, yeah. in our mind, in our mind. And it's not always accurate, you know, I think that's the fun part. So the inaccuracy, it makes it more fantasy and more different mm -hmm. and maybe not what you should expect. I mean, we're not historians, we're designers, so... And we'll give it to you as our point of view or what but we, what see we it think as. it could have been. Or mm -hmm. I saw a lot of details, very glamorous look, right? Yeah, yeah because she's from men to dames to ladies. You got it all. We're in this uh, film noir moment. So this is actually the set is a film noir set because it actually sits all, all in black, black and white. Um, and so the only the characters are in color. Come to color when they come out. It's all monochromatic really. So they're grays and tones. And so you're looking at a black and white photograph or a black and white movie and the characters are in color. Are you working constantly with uh, Dean and Day Caton, or it's the first time you're collaborating? Uh, I've been working for them for the last almost 10 years. 10 years almost, so yeah. Tell me about this particular decoration. How long did you build it? Uh... Uh, from the first idea to now, to the end of the work, it was more or less a month of work. So we start with the first idea from them, and then we start making drawings and projects. Then we have another discussion with them and change little things, and then it's three weeks of hard work to build everything you can see here. What was the most challenging scene you have ever done for them? Oh, well, the one I loved a lot was a few years ago. We built a facade of a building, three floors, with balconies, English style, all bricks. And it was really beautiful, with a telephone cabin and lights and a little street in front, uh, nighttime. It was very really nice. 